we have just finished up at the bicycle shop. Tuned the bike up, got things tighter. We got some new pedals. As an update, apartment air conditioning, still broken. For the past 48 hours, my apartment has never been lower than 79 and a half degrees Fahrenheit. The destination today is to go to the college or the library, somewhere where there's air conditioning, mooch off their air conditioning. All right, short break from the cycling. Boy, did he tune this thing up good. Feels just like the day I got it. Let's keep going. All right, I'm gonna be honest here. You guys just missed me eat crap. So I was riding along, I'm cycling, and I'm trying to look where I'm going, and then all of a sudden I look down and I see this. There's the width of my tire, there's that. Basically, my front tire just plunged into this sewer grate. And I almost got thrown over the handlebars. That would have made for a hell of an action shot, but I'm glad I didn't get it on camera. Bike seems to be okay. That's gotta be a record. Rode this thing for probably like 16 minutes and then I already crashed it. I don't know why they would have a grate like that. Yes, it's not technically in the bike lane, but it's a little too close for my comfort. Somehow this thing sunk in and my feet were caught in here. Caught in cables and a lock and these twisty bars. I was standing next to the roadside like an idiot for two minutes trying to get out from my handlebars that were sunk in this grate. I'm back at the apartment. I had to jump on my bike and just jam it downhill to get here. I gotta give these guys credit. Normally when somebody says they're coming to your house to fix something, it's like 20 minutes to possibly hours. These guys were here right when I pulled up. Air conditioner itself is actually working. They think it might, it might just be the thermostat. The air conditioning repair guys just left. It's currently set to be 75 degrees, which is fantastic. I'm even gonna crank it lower for the last two days worth of grief I've been through. Screw you, old thermostat. And the last two days of extreme temperatures in my house when it's 106 degrees Fahrenheit outside. 